Hello, this is Mr. BandoTube, and today I will be showing you how to download a plugin for your Beast Node server. So, you just want to go to your to the internet, type in mc.beastnode.com. Since I've already gone there, I have it there. If you've logged in, click servers, the server you want to upload a plugin to, and then make sure you have craft bucket dev in the latest version which would be craft bucket dev 1.4.6 round 2 so then then that means you have craft bucket so now you can download a plugin so there are two ways to download a plugin one is there is automatically and manually so i'll show you the automatic way so we'll just click bucket plugins type in the plugin you want to install so I'm going to put an anti-build, a plugin I used to have that I don't need anymore. Click it. Click install. Now the plugins that have less, like, um, I don't know how, what you want to call it, like data, can install manually or automatically like this. So then you can remove it or disable it. So I'm going to remove because I don't need it. So then you have to download it manually sometimes. So make a new window. And you type in bucket.org. This is the Bucket Forums website. So you already have Craft Bucket on your server since I showed you. And then click Get Plugins. Here, type in a real. This is where you can get any plugin with no um, difficulty. So I'm just going to type in world edit, a very, very nice um, plugin that allows you to just edit things a lot faster and build a lot faster. So click, click it, then click download, and then click download again. Make sure you remember it's world edit at 5.4.5. So if you have to look it up in your finder, just type that in. Since it just shows me all my downloads, it will just be right there. So right here is your worldedit.jar. So that's what you're going to need to download. So um, go back to your server. Click back. Go to files. FTP file access. Then type in your multi-craft password. So it's usually a pretty hard password to remember. Just log in. Then click upload. Then type in plugins here. But sometimes it will be it will automatically do it. And click choose file. Then type in put press your world edit file. Then worldedit.jar choose. Then click submit. So, um, the, so here are the three things you need to know. Oh, okay, so, the maximum size of one file is 64 megabytes. So that's kind of, that would be, be hard to find a plugin that big. Um, the maximum upload time is 600 seconds. So that's how long it might take to upload one. So since I already had World Edit, it will just be overwritten. So that's important if you already have the plugin. So then just click FTP client. If you already have memorized, if it's pass, if it's already memorized your password, just click log in and leave it empty. Then um, click plugins. Then down here um, will be worldedit.jar, and it will obviously show the day that you downloaded it. So January twelfth at nine oh two. And then you know that it's been overwritten. So, um, to delete a plugin, I mean, I don't, I don't, I shouldn't really delete anything, but I'll delete a plugin I don't need. Just check a box, but by a plugin you don't want. So, um, let's see, what's a plugin I don't need? Well, I don't need essentials.zip because I have the jar file. So just click the check and delete. And then submit, and it's deleted, just like that. 
So then if you go into your Minecraft and you're not sure that you downloaded World Edit, it will definitely work if you see it in your in your um, directory of plugins. Whoa. So just click multiplayer, click your server, which you probably have there. Whoopsie. Okay. So then pull out a wooden axe. I already have one out because I use it all the time. And then just left click, first position set, right click, like that. Then do slash set the, either the name of the block or the IP of the block. So if you did five, it would turn into wood planks. And then if you're like, oh, that's not good, just do slash undo. So that shows it works. Um, thanks for watching. In my next video, I will um, show you how to... Um, should I show you in my next video? And that's the main thing you probably want to do with your server. Um, but there are many plugins you can download. Whoa, a pig on a tree, cool. Yeah, there are many things you can do. You can download tons of plugins, and that makes your server the best, really. So go and download a plugin before you start really anything in your server, because it's kind of a hassle to um, do it without World Edit. And um, you can always contact um, Beast Node if your world edit's not working. But if it isn't working, go back to your server's main title and click restart, and then world edit will be working for sure. So thanks for watching again. And um, I'll have to think about what I'll show you in my next video. So this is Mr. VandalTube saying goodbye, um, give me a thumbs up or thumbs down, leave questions in the comments so I can answer them with another video, and that's about it. Thanks for watching again.